In this video, we'll explore the depths of stellar and supermassive black holes, experience the cosmic roller coaster of spaghettification, and marvel at the awe-inspiring beauty of accretion disks. We'll even take a selfie with time dilation. So buckle up and let's dive into the abyss. First, let's talk about the two kinds of black holes we're going to visit. Stellar black holes are like the high school bullies of the cosmos, formed when massive stars collapse under their own gravity. They pack a punch with three to 10 times the mass of our sun, but are a lot smaller in size. On the other hand, supermassive black holes are the big bosses of the universe. They sit at the centers of galaxies, ruling their domains with masses millions to billions of times that of our sun. They're like cosmic whales, only far more mysterious and with a taste for, well, everything. Our first stop is a stellar black hole. As we approach, we notice the gravitational pull getting stronger. It's like the black hole is saying, hey, come here, I've got some awesome cosmic secrets to share. But be warned, folks, stellar black holes can't keep secrets, nor can they keep their hands to themselves. Say hello to spaghettification. The tidal forces here are so strong that I'm being stretched into a long, thin strand of spaghetti. Ouch. It's a horrible way to lose weight, but it sure is effective. And you thought yoga was painful. Now, let's mosey on over to a supermassive black hole. As we approach, the tidal forces are much weaker due to its immense size. Our cosmic whale friend is playing nice. We can cross the event horizon without turning into space pasta. Phew, that's a relief. Time for a quick selfie before we go in. But wait, what's this? Time dilation is happening, and it's messing with our selfie game. The closer we get to the event horizon, the slower time appears to pass for us relative to our friends back home. So, while we're here taking the ultimate space plunge, our friends on Earth are probably wondering why we haven't posted a new video in ages. Talk about a scheduling nightmare. As we get closer to our supermassive buddy, we encounter a beautiful yet deadly cosmic light show. Behold, the accretion disk. Matter spirals inwards and gets super hot, like a cosmic pizza fresh out of the oven. And just like a pizza, it emits radiation in various flavors, x-rays, gamma rays, you name it. This radiation can be lethal, so we better have our SPF 1 million sunscreen on hand. Here we go, folks. We've crossed the event horizon, the point of no return. It's like a cosmic hotel with the famous slogan, you can check in, but you can never leave. Say goodbye to Earth because this is a one-way trip to the heart of darkness. But hey, at least the view is breathtaking. As we free fall into the abyss, we might expect things to get a bit crowded. You know, with all the matter that's fallen in before us. But surprisingly, it's quite roomy in here. We're drifting in a relatively empty space, contemplating our fate and the mysteries of the universe. It's like cosmic meditation, only without the soothing background music. Alas, our journey is nearing its end. We're approaching the singularity, the point where all the mass of the black hole is concentrated. All the cosmic adventures, the fun, the excitement, and the stretching, uh, ouch, have led us to this moment. So, what happens when we reach the singularity? Well, to put it simply, we're about to become one with the universe. Quite literally, we'll be crushed into an infinitely small point, joining the cosmic mass that's been accumulating here since the dawn of time. Talk about becoming a part of something bigger than ourselves. And so our journey comes to an end. As they say, all good things must come to an end, and so must our adventure. Thank you for joining us on this wild ride. If you enjoyed our cosmic adventure and want to explore more mind-bending phenomena, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. Until next time, cosmic adventurers, stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of our incredible universe. Don't forget to watch the video on the right and subscribe. Thanks for being part of Cosmonology.